I was asked to create a cutting board in the shape of a house. So there is my 18 by 11 and a half frame for the cutting board and then some vectors for cutouts. Now that's not the line I'm going to cut out for the board. Those lines are for the little groove that's in most cutting boards to collect uses. Then I'm going to put it, so I'm going to put that on my CNC rotter and groove those out. And then I'll take it over to my bandsaw and actually cut the shape of a house, basically following those lines. So it's kind of a template, but it's also the groove. I have my cutting board down on my router bench, which is always a pain because it's only a 12 by 13. So try and get things on so that we can clamp them down is difficult. I wish I had a 24 by 24, but alas, money. And I have zeroed my router. I have a angle bit instead of a straight edge bit. So hoping that's going to get me a nice little kind of rounded or beveled edge. Um, I have this tiled because it's this line cuts 12 by 13. I've broken the tiles into two pieces, the, the, the whole piece thing into two pieces. Uh, the first piece is 10, 10 inches long. And so this is going to cut everything within that one 10 inch spot. Then I have to slide the board and cut the other half or other eight inches. I have done the first cut. Um, point 0.2 is how deep I went, point 0.2 inches, and then point 0.1 for the window and door. I've now moved my board and re-zeroed my cutter. So I'm ready for the second cut. Hopefully it all lines up. Here is what it looks like as the final complete routing of that uh, drip guard. Now point 0.2 inches might be a little deep on the edges. That's pretty deep. This point one is a much better um, number. But first one, I didn't know how to do it. The lining up came okay. Again, I had to try and line it up to a new zero and then go. And I don't really see a big difference there. Down here, I mean, it's a little bit of an edge. That line up on the re-zero re is always tough. So now my next step is going to be to cut out the shape a little bit. You know, cut it up here, come over, cut there, come down a little, come around this a little bit. So I cut the house out. The next one, I think I'm just going to cut this in as a house. I don't know. See how it looks. Maybe cut the corners off, but we'll see on that. So next step is cutting, sanding, oiling. <laughs> 